What's up everybody, I'm Hunter here and I'm a film nerd and this is a new type of video series uh, that I have to call the Schmodown Rewind Show where pretty much I go back into the catalog of the Schmodowns all the way back to when the Schmodes used to do it on their, on their channel and today we are reacting to the very first movie trivia showdown as Mark Ellis takes on Copster. Hope you guys enjoy. My god, this is old. Joining me on my left is last week's Victor. He is Ooh. feeling the pre not feeling the pressure anymore. I it's know. the wild man, a host Young of, uh, guilty ple guilty movie pleasures. <laughs> Thank you, Macoogs. First of all, on the experience, how how are you feeling about well, the overall tournament? You know, um, a lot. I got a lot of sh uh, support from Schmoville, and especially in the voting, yeah. I, I was kind of the heavy favorite. Right. But you and I had been talking uh, a lot, and you had been been sending me texts of, of how Bonnie was responding to some of your trivia text yeah. and I knew Bonnie's a very intelligent girl she loves movies she loves watching movies she retains knowledge very well yeah. so I knew I was going into she a stiff that mom movies you're not sitting uh, here right exactly, <laughs> yeah. 100% you know it was kind of like uh, I, she got injured in the third quarter right. you know and and I just so happened to win in that fourth quarter uh, it does feel good I'm really right. excited well, to congratulations move on. Thank and you. we're gonna see you're gonna be playing uh, Ken Napsock yeah. yeah now Kenny. Okay, so, this is where you come in tonight you have Mark Ellis or Cobster we're gonna be giving away a real Ripped apparel t-shirt, obviously courtesy of Ripped. Uh, we're going to be giving <laughs> yeah. away Mark Ellis's Get to the Castle comedy CD autographed by the whole Schmoes No crew. Oh, and nice. the Boomco Blaster giving away one of those bad boys as well as the Transcendence. Young Blu Wild Man. So we'll be giving away all of those wow. things today. Lots of prizes. Yeah, a lot of prizes for you guys out there. Aww, so let's Tiffany get Smith. a phone call. First, hey, you're in Schmoville. Who do we got? What's up, guys? You got Josh Willingham from South Carolina. Oh, All right, Josh, man, Josh Willingham. I'm gonna go ahead and guess that you're gonna pick Ellis. And you would be correct. <laughs> All, right. All right, Josh, you're playing with Ellis. Okay, so the next poor sack to call in is going to get Copster. Um, <laughs> nah. Let's uh, let's take if the he call. Wins. All right, if he wins, passed out at Comic Con on 20. Coming to the ring, you know him because he had such an amazing showing against Jate and was part of Chate. the reason the Triceratops was born. <laughs> he almost passed out at Comic Con on 20 different occasions, but oh, okay. he is the madman. We love him. We, we love this kid. He's the best. Please welcome Cobster. <laughs> Yeah. the performance a little bit more. No, you can't hear the music. It's all right, Comster. Comster sitting down. He's ready. Now, Comster. Looking good, Comster. Look good, Comster. <laughs> looking good. The performance is good. Did, Did you, you borrow those clothes from Makuga? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Maybe. I would love if I could hear Comster. It would be amazing. Me too. All right. All right there, there you we go. go. Comster, I know <laughs> that this is probably the matchup you didn't want first. That's okay. But you came in here and you delivered. But you are going up against that one of the reasons that we're all sitting here today, my partner in crime, he is the co-host of this show. He is the co-host <laughs> of the YouTube.com slash Schmoes No Show. He is co-owner <laughs> of the Schmoes No Network. He is mm -hmm. my pal that I've been working with for seven years. Please give it up for the main man, the baby carrot-eating assassin. <laughs> the berry, the carrot-eating assassin. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh my god. Oh god, this is great. 
Jitay, how we doing on the camera here? How we doing on the oh. camera? We good to go, Jitay? Go ahead to put this on for you. Yeah. All right. Wow. Look at oh, He's trying to get in his head. He's trying to get put him on head. for you. All right. Oh, the cops are trying to play it, so they both have sunglasses on. The two eighties guys. Cops got his arm around him. Eyes are closed, right? Are you got? So you got? Just in case you don't know how the the contest works, Makuga and I will be running this show. That is correct. All right. Round one. You I'm will, really happy. And this is a play along, the, uh, but you guys know. Wait, am I on? Just yes, you're on. Yeah. I'm really happy that the camera angle isn't any low for us. <laughs> yeah, so are we. I apologize to Tiffany. <laughs> yeah. Now, the now, high angle is showing me pretty much Don't you dare apologize to me, I know, I know you, help, you and I came up with these rules, but he might not know. He doesn't pick up information. So, no, he's so running around getting me beer. Right, so here's how it works. You get six, for those people playing along, you get six questions each from six different categories. You cannot steal from one from one another in this round. At the end, you possibly could leave with six points should you get all of them right. Round two, you will pick out of a hat. In you will get four questions from every category. You can give a, you can if you don't like your category. The early you days shot, of the wheel. You can put it away, and then you pick again. You can steal from your opponent in this round, and you have to use the option of ask a schmo at least once in this round. Am I the schmo in this round? Yes, yes you are. It okay. was myself and Maku. Congrats on your promotion, big guy. Yeah, okay. <laughs> final round is Jeopardy style. Yep. So at the very end, you have all your points. You can bet all your points, and then we will tell you the category. Then you can bet your points, and then you write the answer. You Make know, it a true uh, daily double starting to feel it. I, I came up with these rules. Um, yeah. Now, Ellis, even though you're not going to ask, yeah. I'm going to ask. Hopster, please take your arm away from her. <laughs> All right, here we go. Now, <laughs> All right, here All right, we Calvin go now. Klein. JTE, let us start the battle. Schmoes, Schmo fans out there, Schmo villains, go ahead and hashtag Schmoes know who's going to win. And on the Schmoville Facebook page, have a full discussion on it. Talk about the battle. Everything's going on. Here it is. Copster, are you ready? I am ready. Mark Let's Ellis, go. are you ready? Born ready, baby. Here we go. <laughs> All right. Bye. All right, let's so start. You get to go first. You are the underdog. Yeah. You get to pick from either the, the first series of questions or the second series of questions. What would you like? Uh, I'm going to go with number two. You're going to go with two. number two. Because okay. you are poop. All right, here we go. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> All right, cops are in the category of animation. What was the female, female cowgirl's name in the Toy Story series that made her appearance in Toy Story 2? Jesse. That would be Jesse. That wow. Is yeah, Star baby. Star Come on. Board. Action adventure. Okay. Who played the villain in Die Hard 4? Oh, uh, uh, Timothy Olsen. That is correct. Wow. Yeah. wow. Timothy Olsen. Comedy. In the film The Mask, what breed of dog played Jim Carrey's oh, dog? Oh, no. oh, uh, okay. It's, uh, a, it's not a mixed breed, is it? Anything crazy like that? I'm not going to tell you until you answer. Okay, uh, I'm going to uh, say Chihuahua. That is what? incorrect. No. The answer is Jack Russell Terrier. Yes. Oh, Jack man. Russell Terrier. Mark right. Ellis is wrong. opening, my God. All right, Mark Seriously. Ellis. All right, are you, are you ready? Who voiced the lead character Oscar's voice in the animated film Shark Tale? Uh, Will Smith, the, the lead voice, Oscar. Oscar's voice in the Will in Smith the film Shark Tale. In Shark Tale, who? That is do it a to tough five, one. Four, three. Big Willie. Daniel Radcliffe. Oh, incorrect. Oh. Yeah. Will Smith, the Fresh Prince Will of Bel Air Smith. himself. Oh, wow. All right. Okay. Ooh. In Action Adventure, who does Indiana Jones tell Mola Ram that he has betrayed in Temple of Doom? Who does Indiana Jones tell Mola Ram that he has betrayed in Temple of Doom? I believe he uh, betrayed the god Shiva. That's that is correct. correct. That is correct. That's my god. I'm on shock today. Yeah, yeah, I pray to Shiva okay. every night. In comedy, Mark, who played Matt Damon's brother in Stuck on You? Oh, that would be Greg Kinnear. That is correct. Good out. job. Now, Mark, you now get the sci-fi fantasy category. Ooh, wow. All right. <laughs> <laughs> in, in what franchise in sci-fi fantasy might you find a necromancer? Lord of the Rings. Uh, you would find a necromancer in Lord of the Rings. That is that correct. Is correct. Okay. Sci-fi? All right. yeah. Well done. In, I, I want to oh, com- compliment Tiffany on hiding that as yeah. well as she <laughs> nah. in Rom-com. In The Wedding Singer, which 80s rocker helps Robbie to fight for Julia on an airplane? You know, I'd love for it to be David Lee Roth, but it's Billy Idol. That is correct. correct. Okay. We have the Final yeah, category in this round for Mark Ellis: horror thriller. Okay. Who was the female star of Rosemary's Baby? Uh, you know, you animals aren't making a lot of noise back there. <laughs> <laughs> back there? Yeah. 
They're just right. sitting on pins and needles trying to get through this competition. Uh, um, baby, that is a uh, that is a very tough one. Uh, I want to say sissy SpaceX, but it's not. It is uh, five. Uh, Four. Not sure. Three. Rosemary's baby. Two. One. Sissy right. Spacek. Yeah. It is Mia Farrow. Ah, Mia Farrow. Mia Farrow. Oh, Mark Kelly. Really so Gruelis leaves with two points. He got four points. Okay, four total. Four, four total. Four to two. Four, yeah. All right. So All right, cops, sir. Are, are you ready, sir? Are fantasy. you ready, Mr. sir? Mr. Wildman, I am. Okay. Sci-fi fantasy. In the movie The Never-Ending Story, the main character's name is. Oh, I trade you. That is incorrect. No. The main character. The main character. Oh. That was, that was that was your. I'm well, that pretty was sure that sounded like a guess. Yeah, 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 the answer yeah. is Bastion. Okay. Bastion. Right. Never seen it. Get your I head out of your too. Yeah. Okay. I would have said a trade too. In rom com, true or false? In Pretty Woman, Vivia sings "Princes Where Doves Cry" in the bathtub while wearing headphones. True. 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 False. false. Kiss is Kiss. the name of the song. Ah, Kiss. Okay. Come wow. on. In horror thriller, what is the name of the film featured in Scream Two, which is based upon the murders in Scream? Stab. Oh, it's a stab. That's yes. correct. Wow. Right. Four to three. Four to right. three. Wow. This is tough. This is tough. So he's dead here. Right. Nice. Right. He's feeling confident. All right. So <laughs> here is how. And you guys, by the way, when the cops are or you guys back there, feel free. All you guys, you guys can yeah. yell and scream and cheer. It's fine. Um, They're all silently yelling back They there. don't want to distract Yeah, them. it's fine. So now. <laughs> no. hey, where's kids? Where is Cody? Is he sleeping? Oh, there he is. Okay. So let, let's, let's pick up. Let's pick Cody's categories. sleeping. I, my hand needs to go into a hat yeah. at some point. Yeah. So now we're going to pick the categories. And you now, you, a, a copster, you will be going first. Okay. A copster, you'll be going first. You will pick, and you can put it back the first time if you want. Okay. Stop acting. But remember, so I'm in the hat of remember destiny. that Ellis can steal. Oh, now, like Makuga, you will be. You you want to give you want to go this round or you want to go Mark up to you? Uh, I'll go to Cops. What do you got? Right. I got holiday movies. You gonna no? Stick with that I put it back. back. I'm gonna put it back. Gonna put uh, back see, everybody movies. puts that All first right. one back. Yeah. Yep. It's risky. It By is. The, way, I just the early out, edition of the wheel. I don't know if you know this. Bonnie picked mob movies. Put and it back on Point it. Break. Katie got mob movies. Put it back on Point, point Break. break. Oh, hey, wow. I'm Matt and Summerall. We got one that uh, he hates. I, I, I got Oscar movies. Okay. Oscar, Oscar okay. movies. Okay. Okay. All right, so now we got to get oh, this Oscar movies. We got to get to Oscar movies, and then and Makuga will be giving. I will be giving you the questions. Now remember, you can use Ask a Schmo on any one of these yeah. questions. Only once. Either you two. Yep. yep. Okay. Okay. In Oscar movies, Cobster, name an actor who refused to accept his Academy Award. That would be. Oh, God. Five. Marlon Brando? I can't. I'm blanking. Four. I'm Marlon Sandy Brando? Uh, I'm ask a Schmo. Two. Two. Oh, ask a Schmo now? now? Yes. Who are you going to ask? I will ask Mr. Makuga. Uh, Marlon Brando. That is correct. That is correct. Yeah. Wow, okay. Oh, waste it, waste it, waste it quick. It's okay. All right. Hey, Josh, All that right. pool party at my place on Sunday. <laughs> 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 <Not yet. laughs> okay, two. Two films have tied for the record of most Oscar nominations without a single win. Name either film. Leonardo DiCaprio. Can you repeat the question? Okay, the two two films have tied for the record oh, of most Oscar films. nominations without a single win. Name either film. I know one is Booty Call. Yeah. <laughs> booty Call. Do you want a man? Um, shoot. I am going to say Avatar. That is incorrect. That is correct. Uh, oh, Mark no, Mar oh, Mar can, can steal. Yeah, um, have been, uh, I'm going to need that question one more Two time. Two films <laughs> have tied for the record for the most Oscar nominations without a single without win. Without a win. Name either film. So they didn't win any Oscars that year. No, but they got a ton of noms. Yeah, um... I'm going to say uh, Lord of the Rings Fellowship of the Ring. That is incorrect. incorrect. We would have accepted either the color purple or the turning point. I like point. the commitment. Yes. All right. Number okay. three. Uh, the turning point. The turning, the turning point. point. I didn't even know what that means. Like I didn't know what that okay. one is. Number three. Only three films have won the big five. Best picture, director, actor, actress, and screenplay at the Academy Awards. Name one of those films. Sounds of the Lambs. Okay. Actor, director, and screenplay. Mm -hmm. And. And. Actor, actress, best picture, director, oh and goodness. screenplay. Sounds of the Lambs. Oh, wow. I'm going to go... I'm just going to go on a loop. Silence of the Lambs. Mm -hmm. Incorrect. Mark? Oh, man. Mark. Um, that won the big... The big Silence five. of the Lambs. Um, the EGOT, if you will. Yeah. I'm going to say The Godfather 2. No. Incorrect. We would have accepted One Flew with the Cuckoo's Nest, Silence of the Lambs, or It Happened One Night. Oh, come on, right. baby. Final question. Final question. Who was the first actor or actress to win four Academy Awards? First Mel Streep slash actress to win four. Mel Streep, I don't awards. know. I think it was Bill Bellamy. 
I will give you a hint. It is Bill Bellamy. Yeah. <laughs> Daniel D. Lewis. Is incorrect. incorrect. Uh, Mark? Mark? <clears throat> to win four Academy Awards? Four. To win four. This music John Tesh <laughs> is really yeah. not the I'm going to say, I'm going to go with Street. Yeah. Yeah. Is incorrect? Catherine Hepburn. Catherine Hepburn. Man. Oh, oh Hepburn. Hepburn. That was that was a nice Okay, all right, here we go. Four. Four, 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 four. four. Yeah, no, it is all tied up. This is heated. This is it. What's four to four? It's all tied up at four to four. Wow. Get some. Wow, all right. Get some. All right, what do you got? I got coming of age movies. All right. Oh, Mark. Oh, I put it back. Oh, Mark. No one wants to keep the first Your whole life is a coming of age tale. I don't know. Like, don't the, peer pressure. The, the, the pretty and pinks and stuff like that. I'm just, right. It's just not my. There you go. I think put there's more categories right, what do you got? What do you got? Mark Ellis. Point break. Uh, I got Oscar movies. So, I got, no, no, no. No, you throw it out. Come on, Van Damme movies. Yeah, really. Is Van Damme movies a category? It sure is. We got political oh. movies. Oh! oh. It's it's gonna be tough. the coming of age. It's gonna be tough. Damn. It's looking good for you. I'd like to go ahead and congratulate Tom for the tie going you know into the final round. We don't have it. Political movies. Bring the hat bunk. back. Yeah, one Bring more. Bring the hat back. Oh, yeah, it's, a bunk. it's a bunk category. It's First a bunk time category. Here. Oh, it, oh, it's, it's a bunk category. category. That wasn't worth this up. has nothing to do with the fact that I'm a schmuck. No, it doesn't. I swear. It really wasn't. We don't have it. Yeah. Monster movies. Oh, wow. Monster yeah. movies. Okay. Come on, Christian. Let's put it in there. Lucky break from Mark. In the 2014 version of Godzilla, yeah. there was a nod to a famous Godzilla monster in the film. Who yeah. was that? Mothra? Uh, the Leprechaun. No, Mothra. That is correct. Said, yeah, I, I'm, uh, uh, okay. that is correct. Um, okay. It's 5-4. I do that to you. Yeah. Yeah. What movie did the Scorpion King make his debut? Uh, um, Mummy wait, 2. What? What, what movie did oh. the Scorpion... The Mummy 2. Uh, the Mummy. Is that your final answer? The Mummy Part no. 2. Which one is your answer? The Mummy 2. Mummy 2. Yeah. That is correct. All right, the Mummy was right. right. All right. CGI That's looked four. awful in the Scorpion Who King. Who directed Van Helsing? Remember, you, have, you can still use Ask a Schmo. Yeah. Who directed Van Helsing? Um, <clears throat> I'm going to uh, Ask a Schmo Christian. Roland Emmerich. That is incorrect. incorrect. You're right. I think it was Joel Schumacher, right? Stephen yeah. Sommers. Oh, wow, well, okay. Stephen Sommers. Right. <laughs> gotta ask the schmuck, all right, guys? Mark, Mark Ellis. Mark Ellis is pulling ahead. Yeah. 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 Hey, but, yeah. but he didn't answer it. But he didn't answer the question correctly, but it doesn't matter. He, oh, but he said, yeah, he got said, it, got it, got it. Hey, Josh, can you not debate the rules that I came up with? <laughs> <laughs> all right, so, I put a crap ton of money right. on cops. Here we go. <laughs> Who is the female lead in the remake of Mighty Joe Young? Uh, the female lead in the remake of Mighty Joe Young. Wow. Uh, best of luck to her wherever she is today and whatever Buffalo Wild Wings she works at. Mighty Joe Young came out in the late 90s. I'm going to say... Uh, I knew this one. I'm going to go with somebody pretty uh, high. I'm going to go with Nicole Kidman. That's oh, incorrect. That would be Charlize Theron. That is correct. Charlize Theron. What's the score? What's the score? What's the score right seven, now? Seven to five. Seven to five. Because this is the th now the third round is huge. We will tell you that you know, you're gonna bet <laughs> points here. Oh, yeah, gosh. you're gonna bet points. The tension is palpable. I'm gonna tell you the category. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah. Now, when I tell you the category, oh, that is when you bet points. Oh god. All right. The category is Julia Roberts movies. Oh. <laughs> nah. Okay. All right. Oh man. I'm betting okay, one so point. Write your points down first. I have never been in love with anyone more than right. Julia Roberts. Your points down I first. You know how many you're going to bet? Oh, yeah. How many points are you going to write down? You remember, it is seven to five. Yeah. This is a very close match. Yeah, this is uh, I'm betting one top. point. This is tough. Okay, so... True you're... Daily Double Cops, or you got bet at all. Yeah. Ellis is yeah. keeping his yeah. cool, yeah. though, yeah. pretending I... that he's not feeling the pressure. Well, yeah. <laughs> she, she, you, you bet your points. Yeah. Cops, or you bet your points. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Here is the question for the I Julia Roberts. Ready? <laughs> in the film Closer... Julia Roberts cheats on Clive Owen with Jude Law. Who does she che cheat on Jude Law with? <clears throat> oh, what the? <laughs> We're supposed to write it down? Yeah, write it down. I don't know. I just lost a well, point. I'm back down to seven points. Nope. You guys both look like professional poker players. Yeah. In, <laughs> in, in the film Closer, she cheats on Clive Owen with Jude Law. Who does she cheat on Jude Law with? What a whore. Clyde Owens. That's my guess. This is this is hint. Big. It's not Jason Alexander in Pretty Woman. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wow. give me a baby. Give me a baby. Give me a baby. Give me a baby. 
this is incredible. <laughs> this is one of the best games we've ever had, Christian. We're go, we're this is like the ESPN big... ADL uh, show. Start with Ellis here. Okay. We'll start with Ellis. How many points did you bet? I bet three. You bet three points, yeah. and you guessed? Ewan McGregor. That's incorrect. Ooh, okay. Obi-Wan. All right, so right now, so that's a minus three, so that's a four. four. Copster, you bet five? Yes, I did. Now, who did you bet? If you, if oh, Cobster oh, man. bet oh, man. correctly, oh, man. Oh, man. Cobster oh, man. is the winner oh, oh, of man. the tournament There's of this match. No who did God. you pick? I put Patrick Dempsey. It's incorrect. <laughs> the <laughs> answer, the answer was Clive Owen. Oh my God! Question. I got it right. <laughs> so, I didn't make I the thought, question. I thought you, you had no idea. <laughs> it was a trick question. Seven to five. Just yes, barely. Seven is can I say? Can I say one? Thing? Yeah, of course. Never mind. I just want to keep dancing. Ha ha ha! Like on standing up to the number one seed. That was incredible. I mean, battle. Well done. Wow. Battle tested. Mother approved. Cobster got a lot of respect tonight. He did. I want to make. I want to make one more statement. I forgot to do this before we started playing, and this was an actual thing I was going to do. Very special day in Ellis family history. I'm going to donate for every point that I get. I'm going to donate a hundred dollars to the American Cancer Society. So how many points did I get? Well, you would have had more if you got in clock You ended up with four points. Okay, four I'll, points. I'll combine me and Copster's totals then. Very well How done. How much is that? It's 400. Four? You got zero. Yeah, 400. I guess cancer's going to be around. <laughs> <laughs> that is the Shrows Now bad. Movie Show. You're the best, Mark. Mark Ellis beats Copster, but not as easy Squeaks as we by. thought. Squeeze by first round. I thought we were going to see Copster walking out like Joe Namath. Yeah. I, really, I was like, he's Let just going to play Owen because he has no idea. And I, then he did it. I thought he was going to do that too. Had he put, wow, that was unbelievable. So I get down to my boxers, I expect to win. Yes. Uh, Schmobil, you are sweating out of this. So that's it. Next week's matchup will be Nabeed Makalarji taking on Rotten Tomatoes, Grey Drake. Whoa, dun, 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 big dun. battle next week. Can't wait for that one. So, <laughs> JT. Wow. So I scored nine points in that. I didn't do half bad. Uh, so yeah, that was just a uh, walk down memory lane. Looking back at the very first Ultimate Schmodown tournament. Uh, tomorrow I am doing John Roca versus Scott Mance. The Battle of Bespin. <laughs> Um, so guys, remember to tune in tomorrow for that, and then Friday, it is time for the, uh, for the collision, the col collider collision, four big epic matches, four epic reaction videos. Hope you guys enjoy, remember to like, share, and subscribe to Film Nerd. I'm Hunter, I'm a Film Nerd, I'll see you guys soon. Peace.